without a doubt, all the data we've been seeing is pointing towards a strong weekend of holiday shopping among consumers. The National Retail Federation says overall sales are expected to grow by as much as 10.5% compared to last year. But given the recent dramatic twist and the ever-evolving COVID story, some business owners are worried once again. We're at Planted. For nearly a decade, this Denver plant shop has been growing. About eight years now, it's turning eight this month. But unexpectedly, sales slowed down during the all-important Small Business Saturday. Honestly, I thought it was going to be a little bit busier. Usually, you know, Saturday morning is a little bit more popping. There's been people coming by, but I thought it'd be busier, actually. So, so Luke Haas focuses on other work he needs to finish, while also wondering whether his customers will start staying home. Give it all this new COVID chaos. That's a bummer. <laughs> you know, it's more people being scared as far as being like, hey, I can't leave and can't do anything. Um, that mentality. After having been closed down, having a mask mandate is not a big deal. Across town in the River North Arts District, local businesses inside Modern Novan on Larimer Street didn't feel the effects of fear this weekend. Yeah, we're super busy actually. Customers came in droves, but rumblings of a new variant were apparent. Still, shop owners remain focused and optimistic. I'm just trying to focus on the positive at this point. It's kind of a long year of, you know, being worried about things, and I think we're all ready to just kind of focus on the good. That's that's really all they can do as they wait to see how the next few weeks play out leading up to Christmas Day. No surprise here, data shows online sales are where it's at this holiday shopping season. According to the National Retail Federation survey, 46% of consumers say they'll do their shopping online this year. That's up from 39% in 2019. Uh, speaking of which, Monday morning on the morning news, a problem solvers consumer alert. I'll share some of the best Cyber Monday sales happening in Colorado and beyond. You can catch my reports starting at 6.30 a.m. on Fox 31. In Denver, I'm Gavin Torres.